Three, two, one, we're live. Hey guys, welcome to Hot Pot Podcast. This is the Profile Reviews, episode six actually now, so we've done quite a few. Uh, I thought we'd start off with, just had a shout, my head's really worked, but ignore that. Um, I thought we'd start off with the things that have changed in Instagram recently. We know there's been updates, we know there's been a big change in the way things look on Instagram. Um, the actual platform has changed its uh, its look. So looking a little bit into that and looking into how we can make the best of the changes that have happened. We've obviously had the addition of the reels section as well. So loads and loads of stuff that has changed. Uh, let me know if the sound's working by the way, guys, because uh, I'm not wearing my headphones. So I can't actually tell, but I think it looks fine. So yeah, that is um, the plan for today. What else have I got? And a couple of things for 2021 that I think are gonna be really, really key to get your audience um, to interact with you, to get better results, to get more followers and whatever the end goal of your content is to get more of the results that you want. So let's do that. And then after that, we're going to talk about profile reviews. So we've got a big long list of profiles to have a little look at and um, should should have some nice ones in there and we'll see what we think. Uh, if you're watching, comment along as we go through. Let me know what your thoughts are. I'll read out any comments um, and hopefully we'll all learn something a bit bit new today and have fun while we're doing it. Okay, so let's dive in on the changes. Let me show you what Instagram looks like now. So that should be coming up on screen now. Okay, so this is my profile, uh, Dents of Insta. As you can see, we've still got a lot of what was there previously. However, at the bottom of your screen now, we no longer have in the middle a add post button. We've now got a reels button, so that's changed. We've also got this shopping tab as well. So Instagram pushing these two things more and more. You now have to post from all the way up from the top, and that's how you can do your post stories, reels, live, etc. So that's the biggest thing that's changed on the way the platform looks. Um, and that's really, really key because it means that Reels is now front and center. They're trying to push Reels and basically trying to kill off TikTok or trying to get in and um, affect the way TikTok is kind of dominating the market. So you probably want to look at, is there any content that you can do that's going to use Reels and get the message that you want to get across uh, without going off brand, off topic too much? Um, so yeah, that's that's the biggest change. So I think Reels is going to be front and center uh, this year, and I think it's actually really really working. So there are people like uh, Ben who started his account maybe four months ago, and he's pretty much only doing Reels. Um, and you can see that he's got 10k super super fast, and there's been some of his videos you can see right in the middle there that's done 400k views. So that's it's something that's really working for him. He's also got his uh, his own TikTok as well, so he's using that to push people across to his uh, Instagram. But it's working for him, so I think Reels is going to be really, really key. It's just finding the way that you can do it that's going to engage with your customers, clients, followers, whatever you want to call them, and um, and kind of get you to grow further and further. I think you do need to start with a with the end with an end goal in mind, though. So have a little think about that. So that's the, the one big thing that I've seen is reels. Um, and when it's done correctly, as we saw there with Ben, it is absolutely getting the results that you kind of want to get. So that's first thing. Shopping is the other thing Instagram has pushed. I've really not touched it at all. Um, it's not really something which is going to be huge in the dental market unless we're talking, um, you know, memorabilia or you know, dental products like mugs or stuff like that. I suppose you could look, if you're a uh, instrument company, you could look towards doing some things along that line and push your products onto shopping. But I don't think it's something that you're really going to see a lot of uh, traction from. I've not been on the shopping tab once, so I don't know how well it's going to do. Let me know in the comments down below. Have you been on the shopping tab? Have you bought anything from there? You don't need to tell me how much you spent or what you bought, but, you know, have you been on there and bought something? Uh, be interested to see whether people are engaging with that particular part of the platform. I know I'm not, so I'm maybe the wrong person to ask. It's maybe not targeted towards someone like me, uh, but very interesting. Okay, so that's the second thing that we were looking at. Um, and then 
a lot of people have been complaining online and in different circles about Instagram being harder to use. You're not getting as many um, results as you might have done previously. And I think that is the case for some people, but it might be the case that the content that you're putting out previously maybe is the same quality and the algorithm is now harsher on certain level of quality than it was previously. It's really pushing the absolute best stuff to the top and that's getting more and more views and more and more likes, shares, etc. And things that are kind of middling are no longer getting that middling sort of um, exposure uh, or medium sort of exposure. It's now going all to the top. So it's a bit more disproportionate in favor of the most high performing posts. So I think that's what's happening there. But that doesn't mean that it's a bad thing particularly because Instagram wants to keep people on the platform as long as possible. Uh, Bilal's on from uh, Health Heath Hill Green. Check out the podcast me, him, me and Bilal did a couple of uh, weeks back all about finance and dentistry. So uh, please do check that out and uh, let me know what you think about that particular video. So yeah, Instagram is, is kind of pushing the very best content further. And I think that's a good thing because it means that if you're someone who's serious about the platform and, and getting something out of it, you're obviously going to be putting effort in. So if you're clever about the effort you put in, then the end result will be improved content, improved, um, improved the way the way you're going to put your things on Instagram is going to be improved, and you'll get more and more results because the algorithm is now pushing the best stuff further. So I don't think it's a particularly bad thing overall. Uh, but there are a couple of tips that we can look at there. So you need to look at the post quality that you're putting on. So again, let's have a look at an example. And I'll show you into my insights now uh, in terms of the content <clears throat> in the last year reach uh, and how well things did. Now, obviously, this is um, uh, we, uh, this is this is every post that's been on my Instagram in the last two years. Let's just get it to two years and you can kind of see um, a lot of the posts here so a lot of the pictures that you're seeing group pictures pictures with a really nice focal point pictures which have got a clean background one of mine got there as well uh, clean backgrounds are really really important there's no clutter and they're very very high quality very sharp images uh, videos are doing really well as well um, so that's kind of the way to go but the thing about these is they're also getting shared and saved loads and loads so i'm going to show you that now as well so saves are now more important from my point of view than than uh, than liking a picture. If you're sharing it and you're saving it, that's a bigger signal within the Instagram algorithm, supposedly. Um, and that's going to get more and more uh, shares, etc. And you're going to get further reach from the uh, from the platform. Bilal's asking, what are your thoughts on non sexy or gripping subjects like accounting and finance? Well, the way that you, you're doing it, Bilal. So we'll, sh we'll show you Bilal's profile. Uh, Heath Hill Green. Here we go. So Bilal's giving us some value from these particular posts. So that's one way that you can do it. Now, this is likely to be something that people are going to hit this button and send it to each other, or they're going to save it for later. So that's going to work really, really well. Um, it's not going to do as well as a picture of someone, of course, because pictures and, you know, people's faces grip our attention much, much easier. So it won't do as well as certain posts like that, but there is a good way, uh, a good amount of information there. And that's going to work for Bilal. I'm sure that you've seen some good results from that. Uh, so yeah, I think that's one of the way, um, that you can do it. So it's got to be shareable. It's got to be savable. And, um, the other part was you have to have a reason for posting. There's got to be an intent behind there. On my personal account, I'm uh, a huge uh, culprit for just posting because I've got a nice picture. So you can see a lot, a lot of these posts, really, really nice pictures, but there's not really been much of a uh, reason or, or purpose behind a lot of my posts. Now that's fine for me because I'm not really bothered about getting it. I just want to have a nice looking feed, which is aesthetic and, and stuff like that. At the moment, I'm not really selling anything. So 
that's fine but you need to know what your end goal is so and work from there let's go back to here so that's that's the other thing and then the thing that i've seen that's really been bugging me recently is stories and the way people are using stories so i'm sure you've seen recently you know tag 10 accounts and do these chains now every time i get involved in one of these i absolutely see my story reach half within a couple of days you know with, within that day because people aren't engaging with that content people aren't engaging with those stories and it's hurting the way uh, the reach that i'm getting and every time that i put something on where there's more interactive or it's more interesting or engaging we're getting much more uh, of a of a hook and people are staying on longer and it's pushing me up the queue so if you have a look here this this is obviously at the top of the the page the queue of stories now if you refresh generally something changes so you actually saw it there something moved and flicked forwards uh, and that's the instagram quote unquote algorithm saying actually lots of people are looking at this a lot of times so there's obviously been something which is more um eye-catching which is gripping people more and more and more people are watching it a couple of times so it gets pushed up the queue so that's something you need to think about putting these long lists of 10 accounts that did this and 10 accounts you should follow and this and that it turns people off and i saw my numbers drop every time we've done that so i would definitely stay away from that kind of a thing but that's just my opinion and that's just what i've seen it may be different different for other people and different kinds of accounts um so yeah i think those are the three big things that i've been wanting to get out for a while so use reels get your pictures more shareable more saveable and um, level up your stories because a lot of these chains and and things that aren't engaging are uh, hurting your story reach okay so bilal is saying videos describing content generates more interaction yep yep that's uh, that's exactly it faces faces win so that's why you know reels are doing so well that's why tiktok does so well so i would definitely agree there uh let me know you uh, guys whether you agree as well that video is better than, than photo and then you know a good photo is probably better but better than a bad video but a good video is better than a um a bad a, a good photo sorry okay make sure to hit the like button and, and subscribe if you're new let me get into what we're all here for the profile reviews and i'll unhook my phone so i'm looking forwards here we go instagram updates profile review so i've done the updates there we go and it's profile review and it's live and it is thursday so great cool what have we got loads of in fact we'll, we'll do cruise first because i know that he wanted to be involved in this what's happened here let's see where's he gone he's just tagged me in something so we see what he's tagged me in Oh, he's here. Instagram discussion. There we go. And that's the thing. If you wanna, if you wanna get anything shared by me, tag me. And there you go. You see, I share it straight away. Uh, and that's on one of my accounts. So let's have a look at Cruz accounts. Doctor K. Cruz Patel. Cool. Here we go. Awesome. Five of you watching. Let's get five. Uh, five up likes if you're enjoying the content or even if you just don't don't enjoy the content but you're here because you've got nothing else to do because we're in lockdown so crew's got some uh we've got a picture of himself in there it's nice we've got some treatment as well and some uh, macro photography shots as well so a very clean look which i like uh very uh very professional looking accounts What's good here, I don't know if you've noticed this, guys, he's telling you who he is. He's a dentist, telling you what he does. Oh, God. He's telling you what he does, telling you where he does it, and that's pretty much all you need. You maybe also do want some sort of uh, booking details or something to to get them to, to click on to give some, uh, some details to get booked in. That's the only thing I would add to your profile crew. Let's have a look. So... The got the case so actually cruise case got uh, shared on uh, dents of insta recently if you want to find out more about that let me send me a message and i'll let you know a bit more 
and we've got what the treatment was and obviously got a little story there some hashtags and he's used further hashtags in the in the comments which is perfect that's exactly how i would do it and loads of comments awesome reply to all your comments that is huge these days replying to all your comments is massive you don't want to be on there um, just liking the comment because you want to engage further with those people even if it's something as as uh, bait as going how hope you've been okay how's everything going or something like that uh, just to get more comments in there it just signals the instagram algorithm that this is a really interesting piece of content or people are talking a lot about this content uh, on this po photo and it's possibly going to push it out to more people um, so you also want to be doing that button that button and then sending it to somebody so i'll just send it to myself so that's really important if you want to uh if you want to um if you want to if you see someone's post and you like it and you want them to do well send it to a few people save it that's the way to do it no one looks at their saved stuff anyway so um that's like a super like almost so go ahead and do that to all of my pigs please when you see them Okay, so Crew's done really well here. He's got patient reviews on. Nice kind of clean way of doing it. Again, same thing. Some photographs so you know who he is as well. So lifestyle shots. So you come on there, you can see what's going on and uh, who the guy is, etc., etc. And a nice, uh, nice bit of composite work here for a broken tooth. Okay, awesome guys. So go, go over and, and follow Crew. Let's go back to uh, everybody else's. Okay. <clears throat> I have a feeling I'm going to lose my voice today. All right, let's go down to the bottom. Layla uh, Saka. Okay. Bro, stop tagging me and stuff or comment. Crew, please stop commenting right now because it keeps on coming up on my, uh, on my screen. <laughs> uh, okay, so Layla's 28. She's a dentist. Uh, it's again. Dentist, uh, Vienna, Cairo. I don't know what biker chick is. Oh, she, oh, it's a chick who uses a bike. I should have... Uh, okay, fine. Um, I just sound like an idiot there. Praxis, DDR, med, dot SAKL. So I think that's the uh, degree she's got. So again, you know where she is, what, what she's doing, and you know that she likes to ride bikes, which I suppose is cool. Although super, super dangerous. Wear a helmet. And probably more, more padded stuff than that, because you don't want to get hit. Okay. Um, what's this? Looks like more of a personal profile at the moment. Oh, we, we featured the other day, didn't we? It went really well. Uh, <laughs> he's, he's, he's commenting straight away, crew. Um, yeah. So that's, yeah, that's the way to do it. And you need to comment as soon as people comment uh, because they're probably there at their phone at that time and you're more likely to get a second comment back and stuff um, at that time. Okay, so a bit of a personal profile here. Um, she's using the hashtags, which is good. Um, and yeah, and nice pictures. She's on the bike there. I don't know. I don't understand the obsession with motorbikes. I really don't. But there we go. So yeah, a good good photograph uh, photography account with some bike shots and stuff. Um, um, yeah, I would maybe tidy these up. You can give them some specialized tags on the uh, or covers on the the uh, on the story highlights. And that would uh, make things look a little tidier here. So yeah, that's probably the only thing I would change at the moment. Again, it's a personal profile, profile so you know it's pretty cool. All right, Zach Chug. Here we go. Nine posts, doing pretty well with the followers and following. Following a lot of people, man. Uh, Leeds Dentistry, Birmingham. So we know he's doing dentistry at Leeds and he's from Birmingham. He's a PT event. Okay, so we, we know this is a bit more of a personal sort of profile or a... Um, a non-dental profile but that's the that's the way things go and yeah gym selfie or whatever um mirror selfie even not at all giving us a, a stereotypical gym boy uh, gym bro uh, pose at all anything like that okay and we've got the we've got the hashtags in there as well so yeah i i would use all 30 hashtags why not you've got 30 to use there so that's pretty much it but yeah a decent profile um obviously a bit more of a personal one than anything else but let's let's have a look my man summer he's just done a new youtube video as well so check his out um 
Okay, so he he's he's into so much stuff. He's he's a busy guy. Um, so you can see all the things that Sangna is into there. You've got about nineteen different accounts, just like me. Uh, and there we go. You can see all of them there. So yeah, have have a check out of that. And again, we've got the story highlights. I would maybe put a cover on some of these. A little bit, a little bit uh, more like the first two. Uh, I think the other ones, the, the the first two are really nice. The other ones could do with a bit of work. Let's see. And what I like about Sam is he's got amazing storytelling with his posts, which I just do not have. Storytelling is really important with these. You need to have a reason to post, and this is the uh, there's his reason, and you can see there's a big reason there. So that's uh, that's really really key. And again, on another post, there's loads. Every single post, he's he's done a lot of work with why he's posting the picture. So that's really really important, guys. And you can see he's doing uh, pretty well out of it. So. Uh, is he using hashtags? I bet he is. Yeah, perfect. <coughs> right, let's have a look at the next one. Prue, we've done yours already. Ella Redmom. You're 13, first of all, and uh, private account, secondly, so there's two reasons why I'm not doing it. What's my opinion on giveaways to drive engagement? First of all, it's against terms of service, so check that. Uh, you may you may get you're very unlikely to get pulled up on it, but supposedly they've got AI which is limiting reach on giveaways. So it definitely used to work, and I've done giveaways previously. I think for me, um, first of all, uh, if you haven't seen it already, I've just done my um, newsletter, so I'm going to do giveaways via my newsletter. If you want to win something or you know whatever, you're going to have to sign up to the newsletter. I think that's probably a better way and that way you actually own something you own the the list so i think that's what i would do with regards to giveaways they definitely used to work but if you have a look at the terms of service which i've read through it changed in mid-november to actually those it specifically said you know in engagement bait posts are going to be uh, clamped down upon and they included giveaways in that as well um let's have a look sass sex she Again, why are you guys coming on here with with uh, blocked accounts? Uh, Doctor Brown, how are we doing? He's he's got a really good account. Um, John, if you're watching, please send me your uh, your reels. We've got we've done one of yours so far, but we've got a few more to hit out. Again, really really nice photos, very moody. He's got arm vein, rate it, um, and then his hashtags are in the comments. So perfect. So again. There's a there's a reason behind the post and it's it's doing really well for him. Using reels really really well. You can see two thousand uh, views there, forty four two thousand likes, forty four thousand views. Uh, this is the one that we we did on my mine and we did eighty thousand I think it was so really really good. Let's just tilt that there a bit, uh, and I can just feel my voice starting to to crack slightly. But I'll continue. Really good account. Uh, so check his out and again you can see these are the story covers that I was talking about really really nice and, and clean you can see it just looks a little nicer and again his uh, his bio tells you exactly what he's about so it's awesome right Dental Hassan Hassan are you watching? Hassan's always watching I'm sure he is so again we've got a dental account this time and some, some days scrubs some other days traditional where are your hashtags at man first that's the thing first thing i'd say hashtags are missing there um we've got nice use of video here so that's got 700 views awesome and again that's something that i think views your hashtags this time perfect i think these these kind of videos are really really good and i think the shorter the video it is the better but also have a reason behind every part of the video have a good hook etc so that people are going to continue watching if they do start watching really important i think and yeah nice nice pictures so perfect yeah and he's been on the podcast so check that one out as well there we go so that yeah a good account and you're doing something with dentures here so all the things that we've been talking about he's been uh enacting and it's it's working cool i would love to be able to know how to pronounce your name but I don't want to. I don't want to ruin it. So that's the first thing. But 
Thank you for getting involved. A very new account here. Okay. No hashtags and very little sort of amount of captions. So I think you need to work on that there, but uh, it is a new account, so maybe you're just getting started. Okay. Fuck me. Go follow me, guys. All right. Dr. Shreya Singhvi. Okay. Dentist and dental office. Cool. Oh, I like that. That's a great photo. But we have got no hashtags being used. So definitely want to do more than that. You can use 30 hashtags, guys. So use all 30 if you've got uh, 30 you can think about. It's just, you know, they're there. Use them. Photographs are fine. Okay, so you're using carousels. Okay, I think this is a bit more of a personal profile, but if it was, uh, but it does say dentist and dental office. So I need to think you need to think about what your goal is here and why you're posting um, because there's no comment, you know, there's no, there's no captions. There's no um, direction at the moment, but I'm sure you, you've got an idea. So you just make that more obvious. Okay. Dr. Saloni, it's a blocked account. Blocked account. <laughs> Okay, Sahil Chan. He's a doctor. What's why are these doctors following a dentist of insect? <laughs> right, let's have a look. Well, yeah. So there's a lot of information here, but you, you're not really saying much about it. So you probably want to put some sort of a caption again. Use some hashtags if you want to grow the account. Or, uh, and and maybe tell people in your in your bio what you're about and why they should follow you. Um, you have got some highlights as well, which seem to be the same. But okay, yeah. I mean, again, you you're quite a new account, so maybe just get to grips with what you want to do with it, and uh, and then start using some captions and hashtags and and drive people towards that. Ah, oh, my guy, follow your tooth guy. Awesome. Right, so. 153 finally got over the 150k mark so i'm sure jason doesn't need my help or my advice but his account is great here we go so he's doing a giveaway uh bilal so let's see what kind of uh yeah he's getting in, he's getting engagement it can work but uh, i probably wouldn't do one if i was if i was you but there we go. I mean, Bloody Tooth Guy's account is kind of self-explanatory. There's bloody teeth and there's lots of it. And a guy does the taking out of the bloody teeth. So, yeah. But he's also started using reels. So I think they have been pretty good to him. 40,000 there. 50,000 there. So re reels are really working. I think this one did 100,000. So amazing. So, yeah, reels work definitely definitely work i would i would definitely start getting onto onto those follow follow jason if you're not already and, and check out the podcast me and jason did it was a really good one um back in november i think now maham okay all right so we know about you know what's what you're about aesthetic dentistry online consultations where to find you when you work in contact number perfect that's that's it just in a nutshell everything's there and then we've got some examples of treatment. Got pictures of you, so we know who you're going to see if you're that person who's a uh, patient. Um, some pretty pretty nice shots there. I'm sure we've uh, featured that one previously. If I'm not, I'll, I'll do that. That's a nice shot. Uh, but yeah, so perfect. Uh, and you can see some befores and afters here. So really good. So there's the before, here's the process. There is the after. Awesome. Okay. Then we've got so check out Mahan Mahan's profile as well. Dental life. New page about dentistry. Okay, I don't like this mixed lowercase uppercase. It just makes me feel a bit like it's quite a young person who's done the account. Um my hair's not looking good because it's wet oh well right so yeah that's that's maybe something that i would look at changing how orthodontics used used to be okay 
interesting facts. We've got some hashtags in there. Maybe a bit more, a few more, a few more words about the post as well. Be good. Um, and some motivational quote, quotes. But again, new new account. I'm sure you'll get the hang of what you want to do with it soon enough. Awesome. Dental Z. Todo software. What what language is that, guys? Is that Spanish? Um, again, you need some more captions. Get some more captions in there. We need to know why you're posting it, um, and where you are, etc. So again, new account, zero followers, eight followers. I'm sure it's pretty new. Check that out. Ines Majid. Okay, dentistry, Palestine, Egypt spokesperson. Okay, again, probably a bit of a new account, and you're just starting out with it. So um, follow the steps that we've had previously. I'm sure you'll get there. about that as well so yeah just follow those steps that we've been talking about on all the other profiles and that'll be great sparkle your sparkle glitter girl with no posts yet people just trolling me with this that's where they are family dentistry okay we know who's there dr ashwin matthew george and he's an author as well dm for inquiries so a picture of his clinic that's all fine and then picture of the people working so you know who you're going to be seeing happy new year again a very new account so i'm sure you're just finding your way but again this is nice because actually it's a new account and they're actually writing something about themselves so that's the good way to do it and i think you'll do okay as a result okay remas for okay this mohammed plant i can just talk about that Okay, Zahra, locked account. Okay, cool. Selly Dubon, Turkish. We're getting a lot of Turkish people on the uh, on the on the Dense Vincer recently, which is nice to break into a new country. Let's have a look. I don't speak enough Tur Turkish, so I can't tell what we've been talking about there. Let's have a little look. Before and after clinic photo. Okay, nice. And we've got some hashtags as well, so that's good. So you've got some sort of a comment in there. Picture with some patients. Yeah, a good start. And I'm sure that'll be fine. So yeah, you've got a reason of why you're doing it. So that's really important, as we've said before. You know, each post has got to have a purpose. And you've got some hashtags in there. You should use a few more hashtags. I use them in the comments. I think it works. So that's maybe one thing I would do there. Okay. Yeah, good start. Cool. Dental school. Nice one. Locked account. Farouk. Locked account. Simi, come on. Yes, you are the best because you're not a locked account. Uh, Full-time boss, uh, part-time dentist. Who said that's not your passion at the world? Nobody said that, probably. <laughs> Um, right, okay, let's have a look, and you're on TikTok as well, using reels, good, how's the reel doing, thousand, not bad, some before and afters, selfies, I don't like selfies by the way guys, I think they're a complete waste of a post, I think selfies perform really, really poorly unless you are some incredible model, so don't do it. Uh, we've got a picture there, taking a tooth out. Yep. And you're using hashtags, so fine. Maybe write a bit more about what you're doing and why, and what the post's about, and uh, I'm sure you do fine. So, But thank you for not being a locked account because we were going for a real bad streak there. And we're back onto another streak, okay. And another locked. Saloni, okay, we've got an unlocked account from Saloni this time. Dental specialist, da -da -da, Max Fax, TMD. Okay, so good. So we'll, it's a, a long case presentation telling us all about what's going on here. We've got pictures showing you the x ray. Oh, that's a right mess, isn't it? Odonto or something, I think. Yeah. Um, and then we've got, there it is, out. Pretty. So yeah, this is actually a really good account because you're telling us exactly what's going on. Big, long history of the cases so you can learn something. So there's a purpose behind the case. 
uh, and the, the the post even and then you've got the hashtags as well so yeah cool i like it doctor is on a okay locked dentifix dental practice a clinic we've got the location at least so that's something and then we've got the doctor i believe there as well so yeah fair enough get your teeth spotless so you've got short and sweet to the point yeah okay fair enough that's that's fine you've got your uh, reason behind posting and don't ruin your wedding <laughs> all right fair enough yeah so yeah you're getting on with it you've got some uh, some ideas behind what you're doing i don't like these kinds of posts i that's a personal sort of thing for me i think anything with text on is a bit of a waste um i would much rather have a a video of someone saying something or a picture or you know some other more creative way of showing it i think infographics are kind of a thing of the past um or ads like this are a thing of the past i think what Bilal is doing is different because there's actual you know a bit more targeted information this is very very broad um and probably people aren't going to read much more than a couple of words i would guess but yeah good start radica let's have a look okay we've got everything there we know where you are know who you are what you do check new highlights some nice pics there nice micro shots okay cool yeah it's some some good fit photos there that's a nice one and you've got again a reason behind the post any hashtags yes we have so yeah perfect carry on doing what you're doing you're doing okay as well so i can see you're doing 1800 followers so perfect dentist rama syrian bucharest romania frost resident happy you're here okay we've got a reason behind all these posts perfect and they're good photographs as well so quality of photography is really really important and key so keep it up and you're using hashtags are you uh, i'm not seeing any hashtags maybe maybe hashtags are something you can i oh, know there they are perfect yeah great carry on keep up keep up with it Ambuta is a locked account Rejuvio aesthetics okay so if you haven't seen it this is a video that i made actually so we'll, we'll watch this why not i don't know if you can hear the sound but there was sound as well let's skip through this yeah so this is a, a video that i i actually shot for uh for sean recently pre uh pre new lockdown left 20 seconds yeah I'm, I'm gonna play the whole thing you know why not it's, it's my it's my labor of my hard work eh <laughs> um good save <laughs> hey i'm i, th I think video is better Bilal. it's it's my opinion i think what you're doing is working to an extent i think if you did reels it would be you know and someone was speaking it would be much much more effective but yeah there's my uh there's my work i'm gonna give it a like and a save you can go do that as well thank you um so yeah sean's doing really well with his you can see all the hashtags are in there as well as a reason behind why we're posting and yep informative posts again too many words for me but that's fine these are the ones i prefer he's talking into the into the page uh, into into the phone okay Alana, let's have a look. Another medic. Not even a dentist. There's 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 there's, there's more medics infiltrating our ranks. Okay. A bit of a person, a lot of a personal page, as it, as you can see. Are you using hashtags? Let's have a look. Hashtags are key. Really, really are. 
let's have a look there not using hashtags but again it's a personal page so if you don't really want it to grow massively if you're not really bothered then it doesn't really matter does it and actually sometimes if your content is actually good enough you don't need um you don't need to use hashtags particularly but i i would always use them any hashtags here so yeah i mean alana maybe maybe some people remove the hashtags after they've uh, posted it i don't know but yeah for me that's definitely no brainer to use them in the comments you might as well they give you the option to use it Dr. Shalan Mohammed. Okay. You've got some before and afters. Maybe use some hashtags. Uh, but you've got a reason why you're posting at least. Clear improvement, shape, and content. Okay. That's a nice end as well. Yeah. Some nice some endos there. Okay. So, yeah. Just think about the things we've been speaking about. Uh, we want some more. Uh, reason why you're posting more hashtags and before and afters are all, all well and good okay only a few left now before my my throat goes i can just feel my my voice closing up <coughs> dentist signature signature smiles dental clinic hyderabad 2016 okay Check out the video I shared with you on the account. Yeah, one sec, I'll, I'll finish these off and then we'll have a look at that. Never let success go to your head and let your failure go to your heart. Okay. So some of them have got a caption, some of them haven't. I would always try and have a caption. I would always try and try and have hashtags as well to be a little bit um, inconsistent there. Okay. Hassan, my man, personal account. Uh, I know it's because I know him. He's using all the hashtags, love it. Got a nice uh, blurb there, some cool pics as well. So yeah, I really, I really like this one. It's a great, great shot. Great shot. Now again, we've got hashtags and all the credits for the photo, stuff like that. Oh, look at that one. Where's that? Regatta Red Sea. All right. So yeah, that's Hassan's Dr. Mo. He's using a lot of reels, um, as you can see there, and they're doing fairly well. A couple of thousand views each. Some of them doing really well. Sixty thousand on that one. Reels is just a numbers game, and working out which, what kind of content is going to resonate with your audience, and then going all all in and, and getting more of that more of that content. So yeah, but it definitely works as we saw with uh, Ben Kim's. So. He does funny videos and uh, song covers, so check that out as well. But again, you can see he's got nice covers so on these story highlights, so it's nice and clean. And he's doing well with it, 20, 22,000 followers almost. And the last one, Safina. Let's have a look. MBA student, traveler, businesswoman, not even a, not even a, a medic this time. Okay. Got the hashtags, got some some uh, caption in there as well. I wonder how many non-dentists are actually following Dentist Minster and why. That, that'd be the interesting thing. But yeah, okay, got some nice pictures there. That's a really good pick. Well done. All right, let's have a look at the... Check out the video I shared with you on my account. Right, let's have a look at what Bilal sent me. Yes, you're talking into the camera. I can't hear it because I'm plugged in and I don't know if you guys can hear that either. But this is the kind of thing that I, I, I like more. And maybe even having some sort of montage similar to what I did with Sean or having some pop-ups making them really, really eye-catching is, is a good way to go. I'll check that out afterwards because I actually can't hear what it's saying. Hassan saying thanks for the view. No problem, man. Some uh, some nice videos in there as well. I saw uh, that we uh, we did of yours. Don't see anything interesting here. Oh right, yeah. So I'll show you what you absolutely should not be doing. Let's go. And I've gotten this a few times, and it's uh, it's a little bit weird. There's is this doing automated things. 
and first of all, you can't really tell, but then you read through and goes, looking for a d to partner with a dentist in the US. Okay. Have they just misread my profile? I oh, know it's pretty clear I'm from the UK. So I don't know. Don't be just like cold DMing people. I think it's a bit with stuff like that, especially, you know, it's clearly not an actual person behind this account because if you have a look at this, Hassan is the most responsive minor on IG. Two followers, 70 following. So yeah, there's, some, there's definitely something a bit dodgy going on here. I'm probably going to actually block this one. Yeah, see you later. So yeah, that's that's one thing I definitely would would uh, not be doing is, is you know, getting a bit pushy in the DMs. I think it, it, it winds people up more than it gets you anything. Just be like nice and normal if you are going to do something like that. And uh, the other thing is don't ask to ask a question. If you're going to ask a question, ask the question because that's just long. And uh, again, CVA. Uh, but guys, that's been the uh, profile review. Hopefully you found that interesting. Hopefully there's been some bits that you hadn't really thought about before that you can go ahead and uh, look at and do. Um, let me know what you thought of all the points that I brought up. Is there anything that you hadn't thought about before that's uh, life-changing for you? Um, probably not, but if there is, let me know. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already share the video because that's really really important it gets me uh, a lot of uh, extra views and extra um traction on the youtube youtube uh hit that upvote button and yeah that's pretty much it oh yeah if you've not already done so sign up to my um i'll show you this actually sign up to this here so we've now got a newsletter where i'm going to be putting any offers that people send me in um so yeah, anything that's going to be anything that's going to be an offer for a lecture, webinar, products, discounts, etc. is going to be on there now because uh, I don't want to ruin the look of my Instagram by putting loads and loads of stuff like that on all the time. Uh, okay, let's take that off. Cool. Please give us tips on how to look sexy on the gram. Uh, get a good photographer. Uh, and learn Photoshop. Um, loads to take away from this. Thanks, Blow. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, newsletter. How how often am I going to do it? Maybe maybe twice a month. I think at the moment. Um, so that's going to be the the new thing that I'm working on, as well as all the other things that I'm working on. So hopefully we'll get some good offers on there for you guys. Uh, and it gives because I get lots and lots of requests for things. So at the moment, if you have a look in my in my requests there's a bunch there's a bunch of different things hold on i've hidden that haven't i there's a bunch of different things um scrubs companies there are mcq companies stealth have actually gone in touch and so there's a lot of different things that that want to to be uh promoted and i don't want to do it on my stories because it ruins the stories and i don't want to do it on the feed because again it ruins the feed um so a newsletter is the way to go uh so that's that's coming and hopefully we'll be able to you know let you know about different events and different things that are up there more often than not so have a look at that uh i think that's everything for me today guys i can't think that there's anything else that i need to get out there uh like comment subscribe share the video go ahead every time you see one of my posts now remember that a like is good uh a save is like a super like and sharing is really really important as well get comments in reply to your comments quickly uh make sure to use the uh the new features like reels um what else stop doing the tag chains on uh, on story because I, I what i saw was the my reach just dropped just dropped like a stone so uh, i would probably not want to be doing that uh apart from that that's everything for me today i've got two podcasts this weekend one with uh dr sahave mtrs who i will show you now digital doctor he's involved with loads of stuff so check him out loads and loads of stuff going on with him so check that guy out we're going to be talking on saturday night i think it was uh 10 p.m bit of a late one straight after the united game and then on Sunday, we've got a good friend of mine, 
Mr. Ahmed bin Salman, Endodontist. We're going to talk probably some endo. We're going to talk football, steak, food, uh, all the all the fun things that we talk about usually. So check that one out as well. It's going to be a bit more of a, a bit more dental one, but also we'll probably go off topic quite a lot as well. Okay then, make sure you're tuned in for those ones, guys, and I will see you all later.